Uh, talk to us a little bit about City then, obviously, the Manchester yeah. Derby. It was it was brilliant to see. Um, and, and you watch all these games on TV, but when you go live, it's amazing because there's the uh, Doku, isn't it? Doku is, is the left winger. Mm. Doku was brilliant right now. I text uh, Barry after five minutes to Evan's dad to say, James Milner needs to come off. And I, I don't like saying that about a legend, but like after literally five minutes. So, but Doku had a field day there, but he left his position at one stage. And um, um, a City player, I'm going to say Foden, ended up in his position. And you just see Pep saying to Doku, just stay there. So he's learning the game. He played in midfield and uh, Foden ends up in his position. So it's very structured and organised. But obviously, when you see someone like Phil Foden live, I, I was lucky enough to see Gaza live about three or four times. I've never seen anyone run with the ball live the way Phil Foden does. It's like ball is glued to us. Mm. It's fascinating. And I'm stuck on the Phil Foden one because I think there's like there's a world star there and, and I know he's playing for Man City, so he's he's at a high enough level. I just don't know whether Pep is stopping him being this amazing player. It's fascinating to see because he was like I again, throwing out notes and names here, but what's Messi? He was lucky enough to go to the new camp and it's very similar the way he keeps the ball and this dribble with the ball at his feet. And I'm looking at him going, Wow, because uh, you see it live and you're like What's happening here, and why isn't he? What you know, he's playing narrow off the right at times, and and he don't trust him in in centre midfield. They've spoken about that until he de- till he gets older and develops, and and maybe at twenty four, twenty five, twenty six, we'll see Foden at the highest highest level. But it's crying out for him to be released for me, and Jesus. That he's not always trying. looking to get rid of it at some point. Is that what you're saying? That he's not trusted in that? It, it's it's almost like he's in a straight jacket in this Man City team. And I'm not trying to be critical of the best coach in world football or anything. I'm just saying, I'm looking at Foden going, oh, he must be a little bit frustrated as a player. 